Hey everybody, Mark Spector the Comics, and I'm back. This time, with a recent comic purchase, I ended up getting in an IG sale. If you're interested in seeing what's inside, stay tuned for that intro. So, uh, this is Headline Comics, issue number 18, uh, March, April, I want to say, I'll have to look it up what year this is, but look at that, that is fantastic, um, says, for the American boy, in this issue, Atomic Man makes the underworld dance to the tune of his gamma rays, <laughs> that's pretty cool, um, I've been like slowly wanting to collect anything to do with like the you know atomic age, whether it's atomic bomb covers, atomic uh, bomb stories. I recently did do an unboxing on Golden Age books that had an atomic bomb um, splash page on there. That was pretty sweet. So check out that video if it happened as well. So I don't have anything from the Atomic Man. So that is really cool. Um, you can see there he's shooting down the uh, gamma rays there at the bottom of the, uh, the people on the earth. Really cool. I'm going to open this up because I don't know uh, what year this is from. So I'll show you guys. Really cool book. All right. Opening this up. And uh, this is from... Oh, wow. This is early. Okay. This is from 1946, March, April of 1946. And uh, who's the publisher? Oh, published bi-monthly by American Boys Comics Incorporated. Okay. Very cool. And uh, as you can see here, Atomic Man shooting out his gamma rays. That is really cool. So, I'm not sure if he knew I was collecting anything like, you know, Atomic Age related or uh, anything with Atomic War stuff related. But, uh, thanks again, David. That, that's really awesome. I, I like that. I like that a lot. And, um, so let me put that back in here. And then I'll show you the, uh, the book that I purchased. Uh, 
All right. Put that aside. So, um, ended up picking this up. I've been uh, collecting some uh, Captain Marvel, Captain Marvel Jr. Um, you know, books when I can find them. And I thought this was a really cool cover. This is from August of 1946. This is a Wiz Comics uh, by Fawcett Publications. Wiz Comics issue number 77. And uh, I like the colors. It really pops. And it's a CGC 6.5, which I think is a pretty, pretty high grade considering it's a black cover. And you can see it's a yellow label because it's signed by Ken Bald. And I think that's pretty cool seeing that, you know, right next to uh, Captain Marvel. Um, you got some uh, other characters in here. You got Crime Smasher, where my finger is. Obviously, Captain Marvel. You got Golden Arrow. And you got Ibis the Invincible. So that's really cool. Show you the back. Shows uh, Adventures of RC and Quickie. Don't know who that is. <laughs> but uh, it just looks fantastic, if you ask me. Love all the colors. Great cover. And uh, it's signed, which, like I said, you don't, you don't get too many Golden Age um, books signed. I know Ken Bald passed away. I want to say it was in... 2019 so um, I know he signed he did sign uh, quite a bit towards the end but um, like I said not not too many of them out there that are you know graded and uh, this is the only one that's uh, signed in the census so that's also another uh, pretty cool thing to see um, centerfold is detached but you can still get a nice high grade even if the centerfold is attached so just you know if you didn't know that as well um, and it's off-white pages, and uh, like I said, it looks, it looks really clean. So uh, that's my unboxing this week. Um, thanks again, David, for the AOK, -okay, for, uh, for the headline comics. This is fantastic. Like I said, I don't have any headline comics in the PC, um, so that, that is a great book. I'll put down uh, all of his uh, information in the description so you can check him out, follow him on IG sub them up on YouTube, and uh, that's it for this time. So uh, until next time, Mark's with the comics.